Welcome back to another episode of the Stevie Weeby Show. We have a very special guest tonight. Please welcome wellness coach, clothing coordinator, and comedian, Jay London. Give it up. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thanks for coming, man. It's, it's a, an honor to have you. I'm a big uh, fan of yours. It's, it's nice to be honored to tell you yeah, the truth. Yeah, I'm a huge fan. I don't know if you know, I've watched your set so many times in the last, uh, this is over 10 years ago. Yeah, I, I, I'm a, uh, I've, I want to complete that road. Yeah. So that was that 10th year. There's, there's been many years. Yeah. But it may be in the 10th year. I can't go back that far. But right, the 10th right, year. right. I'm just going, sneaking into the OR and just in the back, just watching you do your thing. Yeah. It was just, uh, it was, it, I knew it was special. I'm like, this is a special yeah. moment. This guy is really, because you're, you're very unique. And that's a problem. <laughs> and that's a problem. It, it, let me tell the camera. It's yeah. a problem to be unique. Right. You will never make a dime if you, you're unique. You'll get ripped off, but you'll never get uh, whatever. I'm being a little sarcastic. No, no, it's okay. It's okay. Have you guys seen uh, Jay perform at all? Not in person, but I've seen it live. Yeah, I've seen it live. It's yeah. special. It's special. Yeah, it's a self-deprecating act that I... <laughs> That I learned through the years yeah. by being on stage. Right. So know, let's go through your perfect. history. So where where did you uh, start your uh, comedy well, roots and everything? Well, my escapade started in New York. I'm a, I'm, oh. a, I'm a New Yorker. Oh, so Jesus in New York. Do you guys yeah. know that? No. Well, I didn't know that either. Yeah, I'm a New Yorker, mm -hmm. and I started off basically in minority-based clubs. Uh, mm -hmm. I, I used to drive a cab in New York, and then late night I would stop in a club or whatever and uh, mm -hmm. and do late nights. So I got my, my, my early training, my foundation, was work, working the rougher clientele. Okay. The rougher clientele. Uh, what, what do, you, do you remember the, what those clubs were like back then? Or? Well, there was a place called Small's Paradise. It was, was originally owned by Will Chamberlain. Then it was owned by... By the Will, basketball player? Yeah. Then it was, Damn! And then it was owned by uh, Wolf Frazier. And then it, the I boxer? No, Wolf Frazier. Oh, okay. The, sorry. Nick, it was oh, the an Knicks. Oh, sorry. Uh, so I was about uh, basketball player. The basketball, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I started off in rooms like that and, and, and Italian-oriented, tough-type rooms in yeah. Brooklyn. And that's how I got my base, right, right, you know, right. my, my, my way to go. Mm -hmm. uh, it evolved as time went on, uh, mm -hmm. learning where I belong as far as placement. Yeah, yeah. It's all about placement. Yeah. Now, how did it work back then? Did you have to sign up on a list or something? Or I went through the same reviews and heartache uh, that all comics go through. Uh, you can be the uh, flavor of the month, but actually the flavor starts to wear off. So mm. you got to be, you don't want to put it in a boxing-like sense, but you got to hit and move. You, gotta, you know, you, you, you can't be stable in one arena right right was that your question yeah well, whatever yeah 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 that, that, that was, was my yeah, um yes. like how many uh do you remember how many sets you would hit up uh, a night there in new york or? well i would take like i said i drove a cab i would go downtown i saw the beginnings of dave, uh, dave Chappelle, david tell jay moore all the guys that started off mm. in those years at the boston comedy club through the auspices of mr barry katz and I worked, and I got lucky, not lucky, but I worked hard to be uh, recognized at the comic stri strip through the great, he's gone, uh, Mr. Lucian Hold. Mm -hmm. And uh, he was a tough, tough, uh, tough piece of work as far as what he wanted. You mentioned, you mentioned Barry Katz? Yes, I did. He, is he, um, I, I know B uh, Barry Katz, uh, he's a... Uh, He's, he's a, a, was a, a manager, right? Yes, he's, he's like a, a manager. manager. Yes, very yeah. big, and he's always been, I'll use a Yiddish word, he's a big macha. Yeah. A macha, which I, is Yiddish I a, word. I had a horrible experience with him, sir. I will not bring up anything of that nature. Okay. Well, I will. No, you will. This is the Stevie <laughs> Weeby Show. I will. Um, I, I, I was at the store, I was somewhere, and this is, we could edit this if you want, but uh, my brother's Bobby, mm -hmm. uh, Bobby Lee. 
And so he yelled, he goes, what's it like to live in your brother's shadow for the whole, your whole life? <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know. And it, it, uh, you know, it really got, I it, mean. It that sinks you. It, it sinks. It just, it pierced through yeah. my heart. And because yeah. I know, I know. I, I live with that every day. I know my you know my brother's famous. Yeah. He, you know he's on TV. Yeah, yeah. And he just basically reinforced that, but in a really like vindictive, like and mean way. A mean spirited way. A mean spirited way. Well, yeah, yeah. You're gonna uh, you're gonna get that. People who are at the top. Yeah. Basically, had they have cream that that's that's sweeter than cream, and you know what sweet sweet cream turns into what was sourness. That? Right. They're too sweet. They're overly sweet. Mm. I hope I'm keeping a train of thought here, but. It has to do with the oh, cream. I, I love you, it. You, re, you reach certain plateaus and the embracement is there. It, 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 you know, and if you do something of a character-like way, uh, you know, you, you thought or you would think that the doors would be more uh, accessible. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and I, but I always, it pays to be here 23. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> I came in from Pennsylvania and I want to be a comic. I did act for six months. Yeah, okay. Uh, be here at, uh, t t you know, whatever. Yeah, I, yeah, I, yeah. I, I actually ch legally changed my name and I'd like to tell the world about, oh, your podcast, Jaded London. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's my new name. Jaded so, London, rotten, so, rotten. So, from New York, when did you make your uh, your way to Los Angeles to pursue comedy? Well, that was uh, that's some years ago, um, and I the, the the crux of this story is basically I sacrificed a woman's love to come out here, mm. and then the eventuality is I lost her love. What was your question? Oh, I asked uh, when when you when you decided to make your way I, to Los Angeles. I, I I actually uh, knew a native uh, shaman, a Native American, mm -hmm. and then he told me my dreams were in the West. West West is out here, and I went through all the ramifications of waiting online on the Tuesday afternoon, whatever I had to do, and uh, and I got embraced at the comedy store, and I did a show called Last Comic Standing, yeah, and I, I should have done, and I you know. Uh, I say, you know, I was on Last Comic Standing, and the way my career is going, I should be on Cops pretty soon. <laughs> That's my career. What was that experience career. like, Jay? <laughs> the, the experience. What year uh, was this? Uh, 2008, 9. 2008, dude. 8, 9, or something on that and order. Is that elimination contest? Like, how does that work again? Yeah, process of elimination okay. by talent. I, I And I made the, you know, the final, the ten, top 10, and mm -hmm. and then I got brought back as That's a... That's an achievement, uh, man. I, I couldn't, I mean, it, you know, uh, it's amazing how powerful that little tube is and how it <laughs> translates. So, uh, and if you're even more loved by some type of editorial type, someone who's editing the film, you know, they, t they can make you look better or whatever. Mm -hmm. So I looked at my best, not through him, but through hard work. You got to do hard work. Mm -hmm. You know what Mike uh, Iverson said, Alan Iverson? No. The basketball player? Yeah, yeah, I know, I know Practice, him. practice, practice. Because he was saying how good he got. And, he did. Mm -hmm. and, he, and that was his whole interview. Practice, practice, practice. Mm -hmm. So it's about practice, regimentation, uh, and You're talking the, about comedy routine. I'm comedy talking about routine. comedy, comedy as, a, as a human. Oh, okay. Uh, I mean, on and off that great stage. Mm -hmm, you got to be mm -hmm. as honest as, as you are in life, as you as honest on that stage, because things eke out. Mm -hmm. So I, you know, I try to be honest. I'm even telling that to the camera, and I'm camera shy. <laughs> yeah. So, um, did you have, um, did you get management when you were out here? Did you have a manager? Uh, you know, my friends, God rest his soul. My friend's father once said. <clears throat> An Italian based, I guess, kind of tough guy. <clears throat> Whatever he does, do the opposite. Whatever he says, do the, do the opposite. But that's the way, career wise, I, I, I got hooked up with the wrong management, very covert, uh, and it, it just never really went into the right channels or embracement. I use that uh. word again. Uh, am yeah. I saddened by it? No, I just have to go out there and apply myself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Again. Mm -hmm. Being applicable to, to what what's out there as far as modern technology, mm -hmm. I'm very backward. Uh, I'm mm -hmm. a backward type. Right, right. So, so you, as far as these, you had a smile. Now you look at me with fear. <laughs> 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 you had a smile. That was like fear, like because <laughs> I noticed it was like I, I wanted to go a certain way, and then it was just like, that guy, it's you're, you're like, like no, okay. I, you that like, is just realization. It's uh, me realizing. I okay, I think it, it's it's going down this way. Oh, I thought you were panicking. Oh no, no, know. no! I'm not panicking. I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to figure out a way. Um, so did you? Um,
Yeah. So how did you manage to like? How were you like? How are you getting your gigs and how are you doing well, showcases and all that? Well, you know what? Right now, all I do is have my little notebook. Mm-hmm. My mom took a year, year took a year took about a, about a year ago. She had a trachea replacement, which oh. is a, a stent. Okay. And she's up in age, and I've been traveling back and forth from New York to here, New York to here. Is she okay? She's fine, but okay, she's good. you know she's under the caring of palliative pal- palliative uh, yeah. living, which is. Just enjoy your life. Yeah, I hear that. So I've been going back and forth. My performances have been strong, mm-hmm. maybe possibly because I, I've been a little inactive. So mm-hmm. I'm always with the notebook and always trying to create. I love that, man. I you're never, very unique. Your, your style of comedy is very I, unique. I, unique, but, you know, and I just had something siphoned from me. Uh, this is my step ladder. I never knew my real ladder. Somebody tells me on Facebook that eight different commercials with that logo. Really? Yeah, and and I can tell if you ever see Louis C.K., he he'll tell you the history on that. What I, what about that? You know how I know the authenticity and how I wrote it like twenty something oh, years ago. Oh wow! So I'm I, I'm I'm coming here. I'm I'm happy and jolly, but I, yeah. you know I don't know if you ever heard of fighters like Benny Briscoe. These were great boxers from yeah, years yeah, yeah. ago. I, you know sometimes I wish I had an invisible. A heavy bag here. I'm, right, I'm, right, I'm, right, I'm, right. I'm angry right now because I just found this out, and I've had other things. You know, sometimes it it it, it you want to withdraw. You know, you just because you want to go out there. Not that you're the greatest, but or, but when you give out a jewel or you think it's a jewel, you know, you can steal my joke. Stealing a persona is the worst. Yeah. But yeah. if you steal my joke, and I worked so hard on it, yeah, and yeah, then yeah. even though it's wordplay, it, it, it just it upsets me. So, so how how does one in, in the comedy in the co- comedy community how does one deal with that? Because I know I'd love to confront the person, yeah, or persons, and just look in their face and tell. And I'd love to hear them say, uh, "Yeah, I wrote that when I was yeah, yeah, yeah." Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. I, I, I got a, I, it. Gave me it gave me a little bit of an invisible chip on my shoulder, right? Because you know I know how they dealt with uh, you know the Joe Rogan and uh, Carlos Mencia. Thing. I was there that night. You, oh, you were? Yes, I was. Well, your brother was there too yes oh, i was there that night so what let's let's talk about that night uh so, very volatile he called him off he said you night i don't want to imitate a star trouble yeah, yeah, but yeah. you know he imit he chastised his authenticity uh joe rogan then he got all vocally hostile and i'm waiting on stage like this i don't i don't think oh so like, you're you're in the or I, i'm supposed to yeah it was an you're amazing, on the lineup this is the or yeah and i'm like Do you know like, this and I didn't I'm, know and, James and was I'm, here. Yes, I was. Oh, and, my and, I, and I'm like, oh, you, oh, you, you know, I, I started, I thought he got very elderly and Jewish at yeah, the same yeah, time. Yeah, I'm yeah. like, oh, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. you know, because he had a friend out a motorcycle outside. I don't know if they were both, you know, what the story was. But and and he suffered. Joe for, Joe Rogan suffered from that because he should he should have been there. He should have been playing. He was, I think, banned for. He a few was months. banned from the store. Yeah, and yeah. I was there that and night. Manage, didn't management drop him or? I don't know, but I was there that night, yeah. and I I don't want to talk anymore now. Oh, but, you know that, but, that's but fine. I, I yeah, yeah, yeah. He, you uh, felt that. One hundred percent. You know, not only saying all right or whatever, but not you know not to be banned for something like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. He was just telling the world to be honest. Don't you know? Don't siphon. Don't you know? Don't you know? Don't play games with people's careers. Yeah. Well, what, break what down does. the the uh, break down the uh, the definition of siphon for those because we have to like, siphon is to steal. <laughs> <laughs> it's to steal. Right. So I'm, I'm glad he clarified that. I don't so, know much of the English language. Because when you language. said that, I'm like, oh. Like to siphon, to term. take, yeah. to be cute about it. So, okay, so. Covert. In today's world, couldn't you, through social media, I don't know, I hope you guys are on the same page, couldn't you direct message them or meet them, at, like, hey, can you meet me at this coffee shop? Let's talk Let's talk this out. Well, so, if I may say, and not yeah, to, do, yeah, not yeah. to no, I hope I'm not breaking in. No, 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 you can, no, 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 you're good. Uh-uh. Not to break in, I, I'm not computer savvy. I pay somebody to man my website mm-hmm. and whatever, so I'm very archaic it's with okay. today's modern way. Mm-hmm. But I wish I, in some way, not, not just not be confrontational, but like just go up to that person. Yeah, I would love to meet eight of those people or whatever, seven. So there's these, that many people. Yeah, yeah. Who took your stuff? Uh, who, who put it on there? It's it's on Facebook. Me, 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 memes. And if you see, this is my stepladder. You'll see. Well, that's your. It, it, Intellectual property—that's yours. I know, See, but you know, it's not about right? the—it's not about the monetary. It's about the I, the audacity of taking. I, I don't know. Yeah, and, and, that's and, wrong. And, I don't and agree royal, with that. And why not the royalty? It, exactly. So, in my opinion, you need to be compensated for the stuff that they. Do you know any took? good lawyers out there? Please help me. I'm falling. Do you yeah. know any lawyers? 
No, this if is they, the truth, if, man. If they credited you, would that be no, better? I would love it. I'll take that. You'll take that? Because I'm being credited. You're being credited. But don't you dare. Don't you dare. You know. Uh, right, right, don't you right, dare. right, right, right. So that's why I seem a little Yeah, no, no, no. You know, little, rightfully so. You know, I think just, any, and other anybody incidentals, would feel that way. Other incidentals. I, 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 I don't want to come here no, no, as if I you are, th- you know, as I was saying earlier, a therapist. Yeah. I don't want you to be a three-panel parole board. No, no. <laughs> yeah. Three-panel. So how do you deal with these, these stresses in life and, and, and through well, these? Well, uh, at least, thank God I got weights at home. Mm-hmm. Uh, you know, uh, it, it's basically exercising. You wouldn't believe it. And I used to do a lot of swimming, you know, uh, Long-term swimming, you know, in, in city pool, uh, you know, out in uh, riv- 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 Riverside over mm-hmm. here in Las yeah, Vegas yeah, yeah, yeah. or in Glassell Park, wherever. Mm-hmm. So I did it by that, you know. And now uh, it's basically banging my head on a wall every three minutes. And that's oh, really wow. helping me. Seriously. Wow. No, what I'm yeah, saying yeah, is yeah, that yeah. I through exercise, creativity, and... Uh, uh, I, I look to inebriate. Uh, you know, I'm not going to get into sobriety. Yeah, 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 yeah. But I definitely need something to uh, to warm the waters. No, I hear that. Yeah, yeah. You know, and that's it. So are you still are you still doing comedy, though, correct? Sir? Still doing comedy. I, I like, was, yeah, come uh, on, man. That's great. I, I, had a rousing, that's great. I had a rousing performance out on Long Island yeah. at the Claritin Hotel. I'm trying to retrieve the tape to give it to Late Night. Mm-hmm. I can't even get a response there. And it's about and all of, of all Your my... Your time pro- is due. They, they, you... you I mean, you've done paid your dues. What do you guys say? I, 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 and again, I'm not looking. I love using this word empathy. It, mm. It's just been as as a person that, that once said, "Totally wad." It's been totally wad. Yeah, yeah. I'll drain this room. Go yeah. ahead. No, no. What energy? But this is great because right. this platform is going to educate. Because we have younger viewers, we have older viewers, we have you know, we have all types of you know. A wide range of viewers. Correct. And so that's the reason why I want people like you, so people learn about people like you, so they well, know the history of where the, the realness. This guy, he's the, this is the real thing here, right? <laughs> Thank you so much. He's the real thing. I've seen it in person, yeah. and uh, I just wanted to shine a light on that, Jay. That's why just Thank you, you so being much. on here, it's, a, it's an honor. And um, thank you so much. I would much, like to man. hear more stories. To be well, honest I'll, with I'll you. give you my a greatest story in comedy yeah. uh, for me. One of my great story. Uh, certain people in life, in their younger years, mm-hmm. uh, they do something that's on the crooked road. Yeah. And then they do a one eighty. Give me an example. A one eighty. Uh, somebody commits this or commits that, and let's say they're rehabilitated. Yeah. Correct. And this and that and all that. And then they change your life. It do a 180. Not a life of, let's say, crime or a life of whatever it may be in a negative way. So my story is how I was tested through so many years of the doing uh, it. Uh, of just trying to be honest. Yeah, it's yeah, it's yeah, a yeah. job being honest yeah, yeah, sometimes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, at all times. But the point I'm bringing out is that I was performing at the Paris Hotel and it was the finals of, of uh, Last Comic Standing. Where was that located? At the Paris Hotel in, Ve- oh, in, Las, in Las Vegas. Las Vegas. Okay. Okay. So with that, uh, I would, my customary thing would to be a, a, go to this little French pastry shop, get a cu- cup of coffee and a little pastry of some sort and again, go over notes because that night I, I had everything yeah, tight. Yeah, yeah. Go over notes. How much time did you have? Uh, only, but they gave you seven. They give you minutes, seven minutes. Six minutes, something oh, okay. like that. So, so with you're fine tuning this. Yeah, okay, uh, always at the, at the end. Place. Always, yeah, yeah. At, you know, getting mm-hmm. well placement, this that. Mm-hmm. So with that, I had to use the bathroom. The, the, I had to use the bathroom. So I go to the bathroom, and all the latrines are are uh, being occupied. And then I see a stall, and I go into the stall, and I'm uh, urinating. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you're taking a piss. Is that yeah? Is that too much? No, no. You you can just say. So with with that, I turn over here and I see this little bag with chiffon on it, a chiffon little bag, and it was from a jewelry store. uh, From a jewelry store. So with that, there's a there's a Nigerian uh, shoe shine guy, and I had noticed him, and I asked him, "Is there a Pinkerton around?" I didn't even want to know what was in there because I knew it was expensive. Oh, yeah, for Wait, sure. So I say, is there a pink and tin around here? And a Nigerian guy, well, we'll, we'll uh, Shushan goes, you know, we'll, we'll find we'll get one. I go over there. I had a sign out for it. I go back, and this guy is is uh, roughing up the Shushan 
fellow thinking that he took maybe this bag. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. So I go, I go, no, I, I got the bag. I got the bag, man. I found the bag. And he, and he, and he's, he looked like he's going to rough me up. He was like, because he couldn't believe it. And then he goes, he takes out a wad of money and goes to me, what do you want? And I, I and I'm a schmuck, I'm a schmuck today. I should have taken it. But the point is, I went, no. I said, why don't you just say, give him a, a forgiveness, the shoeshine guy. With that, there was, it, it, was, it, it, was, it was like a $20,000 engagement ring. Wait, if that, if, if that was so many, if I was in my teenage years or whatever, man, that would have been mine. I don't, I don't mean to be that way, but yeah, that would have yeah. been mine. Yeah. But I, I gave it back. I you didn't did the honest wait, thing. Wait, 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 wait. So with that, I'm going back to the elevator, and I tell this comic, I, I won't mention name, uh, he goes, hey, how you doing? I said, you know, I just found this engagement ring. Yeah. Hey, why don't we go up to your room and look at it? Why don't we go up to your room? Why don't we? Go up to your room, meaning me and him. Why? He says, this is a no good person yeah, looking yeah. to see if maybe the ring could be broken down or whatever. So my point is, on that night, I got a standing ovation from Drew Carey, whoever and whatever, and I've always felt who you are off that stage is who you got to be on that stage. And I thought if I pocketed that or whatever, you know, I'm, all I'm saying, world, if you're going to be a comic, be honest. That's all. Man, you're a straight Be shooter. Honest. That's 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 a great story. And that's straight up. Yeah, straight up, huh? I I, I start to get ghetto. I was yeah. told I have the mentality of a fourteen year old black boy from Compton. So that's what's Compton out now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's what's coming out so now. So let's, the uh, black let's boy's continue coming the story. Out. So what happened after your great set? Like did a standing ovation and then mm -hmm. he has somebody of, of great stature. Hey, why did you get him to manage you? Uh I, I and no no I I really got clients I got clients uh, promises then I deal with a person a lawyer like person and I hate to say this I will say it this dude is doing seven years in in Lompoc for some kind of fraud or whatever oh. and and he represented me as a lawyer so what I'm saying is <sighs> give me a break yeah <laughs> I'm just joking. So if those of you who are watching this, uh, give me a break. If you guys are watching this on YouTube. <laughs> how do if people want to manage you? Because you never know who's going to be watching this. How do they get a hold of you if they want to manage you right now? At any state hospital from Monday to Friday. <laughs> for real, for real. No, no, no. no, for no, real. I, no, I'm, no I'm being honest. Let, like, because they might take you up on that offer. Uh, they might be a legitimate, you, uh, well, right, uh, honest I, I, manager. A straight up embracement and 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 and, and you know the, I, I put it like this in a box. How much time do we have? Oh, we got as much time as you want. Okay, yeah. there was a great fighter named Archie Moore. Mm -hmm. Did you ever have Archie no, Moore? No, 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 no. Well, Archie Moore became light heavyweight champion at fifty years old, fifty, and he had over two hundred and twenty-five fights and maybe one hundred and twenty knockouts. Jeez. Old Archie Moore, and they called and he played and he they called him the mongoose because if you say you're going to throw a punch at me. He, he would catch everything, all the, and he, but, he, but he would act like he was hurt. Oh. So he'd take go like this and then act wobbly and then wait for you to come in and he's waiting with his upper, you know, he's, oh. he's, he's waiting for you. Yeah. But I'm tell, the point I'm bringing out <laughs> is that at 50 years old, he became light heavyweight champion because people feared him because they knew how bad he was, meaning oh, how man. great he yeah. was. And I'm not, I'm not a knockout artist or anything in that way. But my consistency's been pretty good. Oh, yeah. And not that I'm being avoided. It, it's just been a wacky trip. I'll be yeah, honest yeah, with you. Yeah. What about uh, filming your own special? Or uh... I, hey, hey, here's another one. Hey, how you doing? You know, uh, you do that. I'm going to imitate somebody else now, not even me. Hey, how you doing? I, yeah. You want to go for coffee at Gelson's? Yeah. Really? A half hour special? And you were attached to, to them? And who? And that? Yeah. All right. Okay. Yeah, your number? Yeah, all right. Yeah. Hello, hello, and then I, I, I internalize and go, yeah, I guess that's why he's busy. Hello, hello, <laughs> nothing. So there's I a, flaked out. Yeah. Every time I, it's just been, a, I, I, I came here to cry. No, no, it's okay. I came you're here working, to cry. You're, we're working through this. I'm working it out. Yeah, no, we're working through this. We're working through this. Yes. You're working through this. So would you yes. say it, it's not necessarily you, but it's external forces? It's it's the town. I must it's have the done, town itself, right? I must have done something really, really In bad. In past life? I don't know what life, but I just something. <laughs> I did something wrong. Some I don't know, and I, I, I it's just been. In fact, I, I at a club, I once said, 
not to sound depressing that I, I'm thinking of moving to Seattle. Did I ever tell you that? No, no. You're, just, you're telling me now. Well, I'm, I was yeah. thinking of moving to Seattle okay. because they Why have... Why Seattle? Because they have a high suicide rate. <laughs> <laughs> you know? So with that, I think that I've been banned from a club because I'm too dark. Do you, do you think I'm too dark for, for a Saturday night? <laughs> I'll tell you, this guy... Am I too dark? Yeah, man, that's some good stuff. Yeah. Yeah, am I too dark? Man, I, I just... I'm, I'm, I'm a fan of yours, man. And well, I, let me tell you something. It's never too late. You know what I mean? I feel like yeah. the sun's still on the other side of the hill for you, man. I feel like if you just get on yeah. certain platforms... Because, you know, with the internet, right, Bryce? Right. Well... We but, could... You know what I'm saying? I mean, maybe George or, or someone that you guys know could feel like... No, I, it just sounds like in. a it just sounds like a Chris, a pre Christmas gift, you know. Like I don't you know, know like, I'm just trying to you know. No, but that would be a, maybe maybe that's a, the interior ulterior motive. I, yeah, that would be really nice. Oh, I just I thought of an idea. Yeah. Your next. What about just I'm just. What about this? I know you and George are busy. You're busy as well. But we have cameras, right? Yeah. You guys have. Right yeah, we're doing it right now. <laughs> so yeah, we huh. could do kind of like a like a ninja. Or like, you know, incognito special where we just have to catch his set, like a good solid whatever, 30 minutes or whatever, and then we could, you guys could edit that as his special. I'm not against the idea. But that's a, lot that? of, that's a lot of work and it's different, a lot of clubs. Well, we'll just, I mean, we'll, 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 we'll go. How about this? <laughs> how, go ahead. How about go. this? <laughs> how, how about this? Instead of, you know, just to take off the pressure, instead of one set, these guys can maybe follow you around and kind of cherry pick. Oh, so, I, I, yeah, I, I, yeah, well, you know what I mean? Like, are, like, are you get, getting get, into the production, whole production side yeah, of this? Yeah, or? or just, you know, I don't, I mean, these guys do all, you know, they edit, they film, they do all that stuff, you know what I mean? Yeah. And, na and nowadays, man, it's like, F these people who are just doing this, if, if you have the means to put it out, you know what I mean? You know, I mean I'll, I'll think of that only because... Because these guys are straight shooters. I, I, I know. They, Especially and this guy, at, these, both these guys are honest dudes, they haven't well, done me wrong, they show up every week you. here, right guys? Yeah, no, yeah, thank you. Yeah, I, I thank you for that. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, 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 yeah. And you. then there's a guy you haven't met, George, who actually does my brother's podcast. Oh, yeah, yeah. So you dealt with George. George who? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm it's just sorry. It just comes natural for you. <laughs> That's the thing about this guy. It's just, it's, he's like, he's just natural. He's natural. Yeah, he's, he's natural. natural. Sure. He's That's natural. why I loved it. Have you seen his set? <laughs> yeah, I have. Man, I've seen, I've seen he's got one liner. Yeah. <laughs> he's got oh, he's got one liners, man. Yeah. Yeah. So we just, I don't know. I just, I'm just trying to, you know, come up with something because I would hate, you know, just like because you know the town and the people are shady. People are flakes. I, I don't, don't want to. I hope I'm not putting in that. That's my logo yet. You know, no, for, no, for no, that, no, no, no. You're not. No. I'm just. You know, people on uh, your, are on your side. The watches will be on your no, side. No, I, I, I thank you. No, thank you, world. Thank yeah. you, everybody out there. We're on your side, Jim. Thank you for yeah. being on my side. Mm -hmm. Seven is on your side too. Yeah. But what does it get me? You know, seven on your side. Oh, I don't, I don't know if I. It's the, the, it's the news on channel. Oh, okay, seven. yeah, 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 but, yeah, never, yeah. but they're never on your side. Mm. You ever call yeah. them up? They're not on your side. Yeah. Look, I so love the way you look at me, like a frightened lady. <laughs> 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 you, you look like you're cowering. Do I do? I have <laughs> no, 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 no. You're good. No, I'm just trying to work through this, man. I'm trying to. Like hey, hey, I'm yeah. trying to come up. I'm trying to come up with this solution. I'm you trying to. I'm not trying to come up with this solution, man. Because you've well, done paid your dues. Yeah. From the East Coast. I mean, he's done comedy for how many years? Last com comic standing, you know. And uh, he should have, in my opinion, you should have. You should have five to ten comedy specials out. I, in my opinion, I'm, I'm glad if I can so, make one. Because to, to, to put the, the, the cream of the cream or whatever you think is that funny has to be the cream of the cream. Yeah, I can't become a schlockmeister. What's a schlockmeister? What is a that? schlockmeister, another word. Okay, yeah. go ahead, break that down. Schlockmeister is someone who, who sells cheap goods. Did you mm. ever see Lust for Life? Did you ever see the Kurt, uh, read the Kurt Douglas book? No. Uh, it's called I, I like Son it. of a Ragman. Oh, okay. It talks about his early years being connected in New York mm -hmm, with mm -hmm, his, mm -hmm. I think, eight sisters. And... Uh, um, what, what was the question? I forget the. What was the question? I'll tell you why. 
What was uh, the question, guys? Oh, to throw out Schlock. Oh, Schlockmeister. Sorry. Right, okay. Schlockmeister. Uh, so his father used to sell rags up in, mm -hmm. you know, that's he made a living. This is in New York? Uh, upstate New York. Upstate, it's okay. connected to New York. And, um,. The point I'm trying to bring out, a schlock is, 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 is rags, garbage. I, you know, so I want it to be real and not schlockmeister-like if, if, mm. if I do approach this and, yeah. and hit it. And I have to do it. It's kind of like jumping off the high diving board. You ever yeah, go yeah. up the high, yeah, high right, diving board? Right, right. You know, there's nothing there yeah. except cement. You know, with you, you so, know, the, the main thing about the attribute is, for you is integrity. Because after all these years, he never cowered. He never... You know what I'm saying? Wow. He never compromised Testimony. his integrity, right? As far as selling myself out or whatever. Yeah, as far I as wish being I could... true to yourself in your comedy, man, what you I write down. I, Can you I, grab I, his notebook, man? Don't forget his notebook. It's, it's, it's yeah. on top of the fridge because yeah. you forgot it. Yeah, that's it's his writings in there. You know, because uh, not too long ago I had family go, hey, 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 give it up already. Give, yeah, give it yeah. up. Because you're doing, look how long you're doing this. You yeah. had your chance. Get on welfare. Go. Get yeah, out of yeah, here. Yeah. It's over. And yeah, you know, you hear shit like, like that, man, you know. The thing today, I, don't, I mean, I'm not an expert, but just from like, please, please chime in if you want. Yeah. Um, in today's, like the comedians out like on with their Netflix, whatever. Do you see any comedians do like that are like him? No. There's not one. Right? Yeah. Like with this, with the other ones, like oh, there's Dane Cook, there's like probably a hundred guys that are doing, you know what I mean? They, they, they're doing that type of thing or... You know what I mean? But who who's like Jay London? No one but him, right? Well, thank you very yeah. much. I mean, I came here to be honored. Yeah. And uh, and it is, it is. It's <laughs> you having a good time? Yeah. I just, do you, do you, I, I what just do you think about the Inca Cola? I just can't believe. I just, it's the way you do this. It's like... No, we're we're this, we're this platform like is to really, raise you up. Oh no, but I think no, we're like, gonna raise you up, slowly shine the light on it. I know, but and be like Jay London. Yeah. Is, it's he he's due. His props. Uh, Give this man his props, right? Hey, thank you. Do you you're, guys have any suggestions for Jay in today's market with the internet, social media, Chris? Um, yeah, I mean, you definitely got to start utilizing social media. Um, and maybe someone could help you with that. Mm -hmm. um, it's just, it's, it's, it's a lot easier to get discovered through that now. And it's unfortunate that there's a lot of people that didn't really pay their dues that are are kind of like yeah, they, are, are getting the spotlight. They bypassed. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, but they, they bypassed it. But no, but I mean, but what Steve said is right. There's no one like you. There's no and there's one a market the for like that. You, dude. People are getting tired of the same formula oh, over and over and over again. Yeah. And I think that you know, you just if if you can get someone to help you out with that, I think you'd be pretty successful. Thank um, you. Thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you. Bryce, you have anything to add to that? Oh, he said it perfectly. It's better than I could say. Jay, do you have your own Instagram account? I have a friend that mans it. I pay a paltry amount, uh, you know, to, to, for him to man it. Mm -hmm. I, I'm not computer savvy. There's some, right. certain things I, I can't attach myself to. Yeah. And, you know, Ooh, as, sorry, as far as the uh, computer and... Are you on his Instagram? No. You don't have an Instagram? Does he have an Instagram? He just says he does, but someone else manages it. Oh, let me see. Jay London... Jay London. Yeah, yeah. Let me see. Oh, we're on. <laughs> we're on? Yeah, we're on. No, All right. I don't see it on here. No, it's a website. Oh, it's a website. Yeah. I, I'm not computer savvy. Maybe, well, well, maybe you're saying, you're, to, you're talking about rearrangement, looking to rearrange. Or, yeah, to, or just to, establishing, just, just, just creating well, these platforms. Well, I, 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 you know, I'm going to, as my friend, God rest his soul, soul his name was Seth Schultz. Mm -hmm. His father was, was the creator as far as uh, persona, as far as the logo. I, I don't get no, I get no respect. Mm -hmm. and, oh, Ronnie Dangerfield. Yeah. Well, the oh, father, George, oh, okay. is the father, George Schultz. Mm. I don't feel. I'm, I'm, no, no, no. Go ahead. Go continue. George Schultz. Uh, always new talent. He, he, he got a hold of David Brenner. That's before your time. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And early Gilbert Gottfried and Andy. I, I remember uh, yeah, Gilbert Andy, Ka Andy Kaufman when mm -hmm. he was young and he was just order mm -hmm. uh, black and white uh, Maltons at the county. Mm -hmm. And he once said, give me a comic who can't pay his rent, has bad teeth, no girlfriend, and can't keep a word, and I'll make him a superstar. So the point mm -hmm. I'm bringing out is, 
you know, sometimes you just got to pay your dues. What was your question again? I hate to act like I'm trying to be funny. Oh, no, 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 no. I, I, I actually <laughs> forgot what my question was. Uh, I actually forgot. Uh, yeah. Well. Um, but you could, you could continue on. Yeah, this is your, this is your show, man. Yeah. No, this is great. I'm really getting things out. Uh, I, 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 <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting things out as a comic yeah. and as a human being. Uh, well, what are, uh, just for uh, maybe these yeah. Um, yeah. these up and coming guys, just, yeah, just ahead, break down the real. What are five things needed to to, to 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 be a good comic? What are five attributes or or things? If you, you have need? if you if you have a an inkling or some kind of sub unconscious subconscious nugget that you think is funny, a little jewel there. Yeah. Don't take it for advantage. I mean, don't take advantage. Uh, if you're, it's at three o'clock in the morning, uh, and you think you have a great joke, joke you wrote, and then at uh, eight o'clock in the morning, you don't, you can't remember. So I'm always saying, be alert to even oh, your times of of inspiration of, of, of down that that you, that you can create. Oh. The other thing I don't want to hop on is that honesty factor. Number three, you're only as good as your last set. You have to reprove yourself. It's a big job to reprove yourself. Yeah. You know, you know. Yeah, you weren't good. This, you weren't good. To, you weren't good tonight. You weren't too good. I mean, if you don't do good this show, you know, pack your bags. Yeah, pack your bags. Really, because they whatever uh, and, and you know meaning that uh, you be ready for anything and everything on a stage mm -hmm. and go with it give them the gift and the most important thing when you feel like you've aged you know I'm not harping on aging and all that is work without a trapeze so it what, sounds, what do you mean by that work without a trapeze work without a, work without a trapeze meaning you know, just no fear, fearless. Oh. I got, I, I have nothing to lose. Nothing to lose. I have nothing. You know, and and I think in stages in your career, you can reach that level. I have yeah. nothing to lose, and not in a real negative way. It's just challenging. Yeah, that's just amazing. to take chances. Right, right. You got to take chances, mm -hmm. and and to the comedic world out there, and you're young, take chances, and and uh, and pursue. But don't don't take luggage home with you if the, if your show didn't go once or twice or even a month, you had no laughs or whatever, you know that's where they are. And 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 the last thing, as a writer, you'll never be better in writing in your first two years as far as what you think your brilliance is. So there's a, there's a window with that too. I think I think as career as you get older, creat creativity ebbs. I'm just saying your best times of writing comedy are the times at your beginning. And, and and never take advantage of it. Wow. Never take advantage of, of what you think you wrote or say, yeah, I'll wait for that. And the most important thing, don't steal. Don't My steal. man, let me give you testimony. <laughs> so I'm gonna give you testimony, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Uh, of course, you know why? Karma is a bitch. It, it, at least I'm trying to believe that. So what I'm really saying is, you know, just be straight up, none of that thievery shit. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Are you done? Oh, no, 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 you're oh. not done. How are we doing on time? This is great. No, pretty good. Yeah. We're at we're around forty. Minutes. We're at forty. Let's let's, okay. let's go a little longer. Let's go a little so longer. So that's how I feel about yeah, that, yeah, man. Yeah. I, 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 I get black on that too. I get yeah. I have coming in with these little inflection inflections of blackness. Yeah. How well, off top? How many years have do you think you've been doing comedy? I don't think I know, and it hurts <laughs> and it hurts me. <laughs> I don't think I know. I don't even want it. Next question. <laughs> okay. okay. Just, just a lot of years, man. A lot of yeah, years, and years yeah. and years and years. Uh, I really never yeah. took a hiatus or any kind of little questionable, little sabbatical or any of that yeah. until, you know, my mom has been sick the last year. Yeah, so yeah, I've been yeah, going yeah. back and forth. But I had one of my sparkling, most greatest performances at this Where hotel at? in Long Island. Oh, in Long Island. Mm -hmm. and, Recently. And I, and I, yeah, and I can't get the tape. Oh. I heard. I wish he would hear that. Well, how, wait, 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 you can't get the tape? I, I'm trying to get it. I'm trying to retrieve this tape. Okay, who do we need to contact? I, I already went through the ramifications. Is this William and Morris? <laughs> <laughs> is this William and Morris? Oh, is this William and Morris? I thought like, William and Morris. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's... Um, <laughs> I should just stay I'm in my lane. I'll stay in my lane. No, I'll stay, no, 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 no. I need to just stay in my lane. I'm sorry. I'm staying in my lane. And I'm just waiting. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, just, I'm, 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 I'm a big fan of yours. I'm waiting two weeks yeah, already no. to get this tape. I just, yeah. And I can't get it. And, and it just kills me. 
kills me. Do you I, email? You call? I try through the process, the oh, name, man. and uh, and and it's and it's a tape I want to present to late night because it would be a great six minute set or whatever not great but what I think is passable for late, late night TV and that just kind of um, backs my my idea as far as getting your own filmer and get getting that getting another viewpoint like another recorder on that so you don't have to go through these schmucks as you would call them well, and then so you could just have it right there at the end of the night right, right. boom well, what hit me, what, what, what hit me the, the thing about that, that was I happened to work for a nice fellow named Jeremy Burke. Mm -hmm. uh, he does the best taco stand in, uh, uh, here in Las Vegas. Oh, it's cool, packed cool. out. On a it's legendary every Tuesday. Where is it located? On, in Las Vegas. Okay. Las Vegas Boulevard. So anyway, um, uh, what's the point I'm trying to bring out? What are we talking about? <laughs> <laughs> What? I was just saying, because um, your 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 awesome set, you said you couldn't get you couldn't obtain oh, oh, the tape. Oh. So and we're trying to get the tape. You know, and there's just been only so many select in all my years, and I mean years of applying myself mm -hmm. to comedy. Uh, you know, there's certain ones you want, and I want I want you this one. That one. And you I felt just, it that two night. weeks ago. It's just and it's two oh, weeks this is ago. fresh. I, I just came back from New York. I was came back from New York. <sighs> yeah. And a guy is supposed to be a young aspiring. I don't want to get into him because yeah, you know, yeah, I get, yeah. can get killed too. Yeah. You never know who's watching. <laughs> <laughs> what club was it, Bo? In Ronkonkoma. Oh, okay. Clarion Hotel. Oh, man. And how many people were there? About 50. Okay. And what was funny was, I thought it was funny, as I'm doing the show, two patrons walk out. And, and, and I said, please don't walk out. I mean, my parents used to do that. <laughs> Another way they shouldn't walk out. Yeah, and, yeah. And, just, and I hit them like that real yeah, hard. Yeah, yeah, And yeah. I just, you know, and, I, and I'm not a braggart. You know, I just, it was a jewel. Yeah, And yeah, it, yeah. everything, it, it, it seems like every road is, is, is for some reason. You know, I leave with another Yiddish word. Besher. Besher. Do you know the word besher? Break it down for me. Fate. Besher. Fate. Okay. Where you're supposed to land up. We're on your we're on your side. I'm just let, I just want to let you know no, everyone I, I, in here I, is on your side. Am I coming off too 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 much? No, we love it. It's perfect. Not too much. No. It's perfect. I don't want to be schlocky. No, what schlocky? Schlocky. Schlocky. Like in Schlockmeister. Oh. You know with the rags. Schlocky oh, okay. garbage. Garbage. Okay. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Sorry. No, I'm learning from you, man. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. You know, I'm with I'm with the I'm with the OG. I'm with the veteran. The legend right here. Thank you very London. much. Yeah. It's, you know, it's it's great to hear that. I mean, the I, legend I, right here. Well, thanks, man. And you know it too, right? Well, at times, not, people not know. Yes, I'm just letting you know. You might not think they know, but people know about you, right? George well, knew about him. Well, the point I'm bringing. Thank you. Thank yeah. you very much. The mm -hmm. point I'm trying to bring out is sometimes. <laughs> Not for ego pro uh, purpose, you know. It's nice to get a. It's very therapeutic. It's going, hey, uh, I saw you. Uh, you know, it's it's uh, you know, and I never took it for granted. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I would have take. Thank you, thank you. But then at one time it would be point. Uh, what do you mean I was funny? Funny, you know, like I get like Joe Pesci. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Funny how? Was... How how was I funny? Mm -hmm. What do you mean I'm funny? I, you know, it went to the other direction. My point. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about, but it sounds great. Uh, what are you talking about? What, what is it? Oh, I don't know. I'm just, we're just going. We're going. It's great. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's great. How did you come up with your unique style? Like, uh, the last time I saw you, you're doing, you, your, your timing was unbelievable, and you would just do one line. Like, you would just kind of like, have you seen a set? Yeah. It's just really off. It's like he's coming up with this off the top. Well, like I, always, one I, always, I always refer to papers that I always have. Mm -hmm. I refer, you know, I'm always referring to something. Sometimes I, because I, I, I carry a suit jacket, I, <coughs> but then I put a little, you know, like a, I guess, carrot top kind of thing. And mm -hmm. I, 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 when, because it's now Christmas, I tell the audience I have a bell and I take out the bell mm -hmm. and I tell the audience, does this ring a bell? <laughs> and that's it. <laughs> And sometimes they just, I get people that go, yeah. oh, no. <laughs> uh, oh. 
Yeah. I was in, I was in at the, uh, if I may say, great yeah, guy, ahead. Richie Tinkin, over, who runs the comic strip in New York. Mm -hmm. I went to perform. Recently? Uh, 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 not the last time I was here, like about three months ago. Okay. Rich, you know, Richie mm -hmm. Tinkin. And uh, I, uh, I, I talked about it. I said, I told the audience that I raised red flags. That's, you know, one of my hobbies, <laughs> raising red flags. I used to raise eyebrows, but there's no money in eyebrows. So I moved on. So I moved on. So with that, the audience, because the other guy was talking, it was sexual, you know, the audiences love sex. Yeah, yeah. I, that's, that's what they used to They do a lot that. of bits on that. They huh? used to that. Yeah, that's what yeah, it's about. Yeah. So I'm doing this and that. And I thought, I, I, you know, because silence has its own language mm -hmm. and I'm going I start internalizing I'm like damn and yet when I left and it was just kind of unusual I got this rousing rousing applause they were looking at me as more of a subject than, wow. than, than a comic but yet at the end yeah, you know because yeah. they first looked at me like what you know and to go on second is not good for me why is that it's too hard hitting yeah, I, yeah, I, I'm yeah, going yeah. like fifth fifth yeah, yeah fourth yeah. Mm -hmm, you mm -hmm. know that that first second like ah, 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 ah. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you every time my Brooklyn story. No, 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 no. Go I'll ahead. Tell you, yeah, yeah. Uh, we uh, love the stories. Brooklyn stories. You yeah, ready? yeah. Let's hear the Brooklyn hey, story. Yeah, you know, and that's from the great George Schultz who gave mm -hmm. Rodney Dangerfield that line. I get no respect. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I, I son used to work, you know, run the club and this and that. So I would always be. I would get these micro cassettes or cassettes, and I would perform, and I would love to hear how I sounded because yeah, you course. can get, you can get jewels sometimes. By you know, by saying something out of the way, and you, you make it a bit or whatever. So I always tape myself, always, always taping myself. So I put this little micro cassette tape inside the flowers that were on these tables at oh, this club called secret. Pips. Yeah. yeah. So they didn't know it was there. Yeah. So That's I go you. home and I listen to the tape, and it was a very pinky. Pinky uh, ring type crowd. Mm -hmm. Hey, how you doing, Joey? Yeah, how you doing? Yeah, I, I saw him last week. Yeah. I'm with him. Oh, yeah, all right, all right. That's that kind of caliber, mm -hmm. but, you know, real good people. So with that, I go home, and he's with his wife or girlfriend, and I go home and I listen to the tape, and the guy, you know what the guy goes? No. I fucking pay for this. <laughs> <laughs> this is what I pay for. You know, and he goes, what the fuck is he talking about? <laughs> so sometimes if my act is not going right yeah you get that I, no I imitate that guy oh. and I talk to the wall <laughs> oh that's what you do yeah that's oh. a, no 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 he's no he said that to me oh, okay, and okay on the cassette to yeah, his girlfriend yeah, yeah. to his girlfriend that's I paid great. for this I paid for this those are jewels huh oh man god priceless stuff yeah what happened to that cassette tape uh, I got. I have mounds. It looks like. It looks like I'm from the uh, well, you still U.S. Have, copyright. Well, you still have some. I yeah. I have tapes. Yeah. I just had another idea. What if you somehow combined all those tapes into like GarageBand or, you know, um, what's the other one? Uh, what's the professional one that they record on? Audition. Yeah. Or digital? What, any digital recording. Um. You know, program, and you we can make little like not mixtapes, but you could do create your own special that way because you have these rare, unique um, moments. You know what I'm saying? You could sprinkle those in there. Yeah, put it with music and some of his bits. And then, you know, like the, the greats used to do putting out records, it would be something to that effect I, where he's got these, um, these sound, you know bits infused within there right because if you have tapes we could transfer the analog into you digital. mean sony sony uh yeah yeah I, there, it, there's a way right there's definitely a way to how do that it, yeah but there's so it, it's, it's 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 there's so much not that i'm already putting up blockers how I many like tapes that. do you have do you would you say a whole closet filled oh god those are know. those are Two, like gold man 200 no, no wait 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 yeah. wait a, a good, a, oh, well over a hundred. Let's put it that way. What do you think, Bryce? Yeah, I think there's something there. There's something there, yeah. where because I mean, I it's did, a did, unique. Th did, I, you know, the hard part is there's a lot of tapes to listen to. That's like yeah, the, 
Yeah, the 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 hard part is actually going through all of it. But do you I have think notes on your tapes, so like you know. Yeah. What's on do you have that? log? No, like, all, all did you I log have, stuff? Oh, excuse me. All all I have are uh, 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 notebooks. I never analogued. I never put anything in in, in session. Uh, you know, that's going somewhere else. That's a lot of work. And No, it's not, though, because this is another way you could do it. No, check this out, Jay. No, no I just came up with it. I came... No, no, it is. But you could release it, a whole tape, as its own thing, like a podcast, you know? So, so it'd be worth it because he's got, what, 100 tapes? That'd be 100 audio... Um, you know what I mean? Yep. Things people would listen to. And people will listen, right? It's a unique thing. You know, like uh, MF uh, Doom, I, like. Do, oh wait, go ahead, Jay. No, no, no. I, I was yeah. just gonna say that. Uh, you know, I mean, I'll I'll go to from one club to another. One club I'm doing eight minutes. Another club I'm doing five. That's fine. So they're not. You know, it's not long term fine. sets. It's, it's fine though. That's fine. That's the beauty of it. Oh, they're like right. little gems. So, like each week, you should actually. What's your web? Who's the website guy? We should be talking to him because through his website, each week he could do a different. Five minute set with the guy talking about you know with the, to his girlfriend. That's its own thing, right? The next week could be something else, and it, we could actually just continue like a long stream of thought. It's like a, this huge stream. Is this of, under a production company? No, this is. I, I don't know. I don't know. I, we have no. No, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, they're their own company. Uh, uh, you're, you're, you're production people. Yeah, they're production. Yeah, no, no, they they come from Maker. Anchor? They come from Maker Studios. Him. Anchor? A uh, maker. Maker. Yeah, they, 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 they come from uh, the YouTube world. Yeah, they come from the YouTube world. So you know world. what you want. These guys know what they want. They, they know the, he knows how to do all this stuff. So you're there and you're, 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 so you're doing as a, a little, if I'm... It, we do other stuff now. Yeah. We do YouTube stuff like this. But I'm telling you, Jay, there's so many golden sprinkles in the tapes well, that you have. You might not think it, but we all know that there probably is golden sprinkles, huh? Yeah, but you know what? I'm, like I said, it, 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 wait, because I've, I've become so fractured. Are we still on? Are we still on? <laughs> the guy laughs. It's good. It's good that you laugh. I'm fractured. <laughs> yeah. The point I'm bringing oh. out is I've become a little... Uh, uh, trustworthy, tattered, yeah. tattered. I, I, I have a hard time trusting, and yet, oh, it, you know, because it, those it, are your like the kind of like diary notes it, or something. It's, it's just my life. That's yeah, my life. Yeah, that's and your then life. to give away my life, it was like doing last comic standing. You had to do every every time you had to do an, a new whatever yeah. so many minutes, and then come back and do another fresh minutes. And I feel here I would just be you know I I I, I want some I I. I well, what can I tell you? What do I want? Mm -hmm. I, it, this sounds good. Sometimes it sounds too good. Mm. Not that may, I'm not trying to be spicy. Yeah. Uh, you know, because I, I, the, the outreach here is great. Yeah, yeah. People are going to listen to this. And, saying, uh, in fact, how about this? <laughs> People who listen to this, if you it's are some idea. kind of, if you can know how to transfer tape onto digital or you have the, the time freelance... Um, to work with this man and to, to be of service to this man to, to bring this into fruition, please contact Jay London. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Jay London Comic. At Jay London Comic on Twitter. Twitter. On Twitter. Wait, wait. Can I get? Can, they, can I give him something else? Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead. Uh, it, only if it's of a, of a certain type nature. Uh, meaning, I guess, what was set, what, what, set your terms now? Set your what terms am I? Now. Just tell me my terms. I mean, the, you have to come up with your own terms. This is your the, you, okay. The terms um, are okay. Ahead. So, as far as compensation, um, you will be compensated, um, <laughs> after <laughs> what are you laughing at? I'm trying to work through this, man. You gotta, you gotta help me out, dude. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> No, I'm not. I'm trying to. I'm not a. I'm not a manager or anything. No, I'm just yeah. a guy who lives. Yeah, no, in this no, room. no. Hey, no one's. No, I think I'm, 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 You will be compensated if something comes out of it, right? Is that fair to say? 
Well, right? Okay, like, go ahead. Go ahead, Jay. You wait, say wait, the wait, 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 As far what, as them the, doing all this work, because this can be hours of them sitting there. <laughs> the work, it's going to be literally hours, hours of them sitting there. Doing what? What are they going to be doing? Listening to the tapes and transferring the tapes into a digital format. Right? Uh, am I asking for that right now? <laughs> I mean, I'm just... I. <laughs> I thought you were as uh, no, well. I was thinking, <laughs> no, I, I, I'm here right now okay. being treated very nicely. Yeah. Uh, not to a point of suspicion, which I am. <laughs> I'm very suspicious. No, the point no. is... I mean, look where yeah, I live, man. No, and I'm, no I'm, but I'm yeah. saying that I think uh, in time and whatever, I'll dissect this and, and render a decision. Mm -hmm. and, and if anyone... I thought, it was, I thought this was about knowing me or want me trying to get work. In a way, it is because through them. Okay, no, no, no. We're on different pages here. J, J, J. Hold up. Let's 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 bring it back here. My proposal was because you you talked about these awesome rare tapes that you have stacked away somewhere. Correct. They're not. They're just collecting. They're they're rare and they're they're pro probably correct. awesome. I think Steve wants these tapes. So, Steve wants the tapes. I don't have a. I don't know how to do that. I mean. I, but I'm saying, if someone out there knows how to transfer cassette tapes into a digital format, holler at this man at J London Comic. That's his Twitter handle. Okay. Right, and and also mm -hmm. if they would like to uh, uh, talk to me, yeah, uh, it, the, I'll, I'll, I'm going to give out my number. Is that all right or what? Oh, you, you want to? Yeah. I mean, it's up to you. This yeah, is your... I, I have nothing to hide. Okay, so so go ahead, Jay. Um, or you can yeah. contact him directly at... Or you can contact me directly at... Thank you. I like Thank that. You. So let's, 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 let's just put this, these, other, these positive ideas in the universe for your career and your artistic endeavors. Right. Not only are we looking for pr production stuff, if you have any management hookups for this man, if you are a club owner and you are a fan of this guy's comedy and you believe in wow. his set, hit him up, book him. You wow. won't be disappointed. Listen okay? to that. Right? And that goes for... I mean, what are the clubs? That's I don't do too much. Too, I can't take no, this no, much. No, 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 no. I can't take that, this. That's improv. Is it improvs, right? Like no, improv? they, they know me at the improv oh, okay. and, and, and Laugh any Factory. Any other comedy and, uh, owner, <laughs> any club in the universe, contact this man. He gave out his number. What's your booking rate? My who? Your, your, your rate. Your, uh, your rate. Oh, yeah, yeah. Forget, oh, yeah, forget yeah, rates. Yeah, yeah, it sounds yeah. like a... a, a no, your, your rate. Your rate. <laughs> My, what do I, my price? Yeah, 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 yeah. There is no price. I no, do. there is, though. There always is a price, no? Yeah, uh, to, to be paid semi-handsomely. There you go, man. To yeah. be paid semi-handsomely. Uh, so, and, and, you know, I, I am worth the dollar. Thank you. 10000 a gig. No, not, not in that range. Not in that range. No, come on, man. But uh, if, I think accordingly. You're due that. I, I'm you are due that. I'm, that, I, come you on. know, I once said if I gave birth to the blues, it would have been cesarean. <laughs> Meaning, I'm so due. So if you could help me out with the $10,000, yeah. I'll take it yeah. in a minute. You, and gotta, I, and you, gotta, you have a GoFundMe or a Patreon? I don't need no GoFund. Yeah. Don't give me no No, no. GoFund, what no. about a PayPal? You got a PayPal? I have a PayPal that's dormant, but I do have one, yeah. Okay, now now we're on to something. Okay, let's keep, let's keep rolling. <laughs> let's, I love this stuff. What's your PayPal? What's your e I don't have the numbers uh, on it. No, 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 no. You have, there's an email attached to it. I have what's somebody. Your, what's that, your email? My email is harrygreb1982 at gmail.com. And that's the one affiliated with your PayPal? Well, I, PayPal is another. That's to, to, to another family member. I can't give you an answer. Why would you like to know that? Because I was just going to put this out there. If you want to donate to this man, no, 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 no. What do you oh, mean no? What do you mean no? Oh, you, now you're making me a welfare <laughs> case here. Forget it. Well, I feel like I came off the street, man. Which <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> I just want them to support far. you. I, no, because I don't need we're money. Here. No, no, no. no. I don't need Book this there. man, all right? Yeah, I just want to be Let him booked. do his work. Let him do his creative. I don't play let, that. Let's, let, us, let him express himself, okay? On stage. He's, he's a pro, you know? You're like, you know, I think of you like Yoda, man. You're, really? a, you're, a, you're beyond... A Jedi. 
your Jedi ma- he's like a Jedi master, wouldn't you say? Yeah, you're like you know what I'm saying? You're on well, the council. That, that you should be up there. Well, well thank you. And that, and that comes just from uh I guess like anybody else does, they want to get get to where they got to go. Mm-hmm. And that is through hard work. And you've and, you've and, done and, you put uh, your time in. I did my Did I you mean, ever see Goodfellows? I love I just saw it last week. Yeah. I love Goodfellas. That's I one did of my top my, movies. I did my time. Yeah. I did my time. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you did your yeah. time. Well, I didn't hear. I didn't hear that upstate. Mm-hmm. I know you were upstate. I don't know if you heard. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't shine shoes anymore. <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> you talking about that? Yeah, well, they the, come the, back for. Yeah, the point. Yeah, the yeah, point yeah. is, yeah. I, I don't know if you heard that. I don't yeah, do that no yeah. more. I don't do that. Yeah, yeah. Meaning that uh, I just love to get nice, good, legit work. Yeah, legit that's work. It. That's, it. that's it. So okay, let let me rephrase. So if, for those of you who are watching the Stevie Wee Show, this Jay London episode, and you want to book this man, and uh, you know. Uh, for uh, you know, for a comedy gig, contact him. That's all I'm saying. Is thank that, you. Is that yeah, fair yeah, enough? Yeah, and, 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 That's d- all I'm d- saying. D- d- yeah, just my okay. phone number and, and, yeah. and good night, Irene. Yeah. Do you remember his Twitter's good night, out Irene? There, his his phone numbers. Do you, how many how many how many calls and text messages do you think you'll get after this? Uh, like, uh, maybe thirty-seven. They yeah. actually listen to, listen oh, they, to yeah, the no, show. No, 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 no. We hey, I'm just letting you know the Stevie Weeby. Our channel has sixty thousand subscribers. Oh, I, I, I had somebody re- I do a review, yeah, my friend. Yeah. I had somebody do a review. So we have some people watching, I had right, somebody, Chris? Mm-hmm. Yeah, and I heard somebody. I, I mean, I did. Somebody did the review. Mm-hmm. So you know, know we're you, on, we're on your I, side. I, okay. Thank you so much we're out there, on your all you side. people. And I heard this. I had like sound like a prepackaged uh, gift of uh, nonsensical wear. Yeah. But thank you so yeah. much. Is there any other questions you'd like to ask, Jay? Oh, I, yeah, I got a okay. question. Maybe we can end on a, on a high note. Yeah, high note. Go ahead. Um, do you feel like you come up with your best material when you're writing or when you're on the stage and just something pops up in your mind? Uh, as I said again, that's why I used to always collect my coll- cassettes and listen. Sometimes you can get a jewel up there and you take it for granted and you can't remember it because it's in the moment. The same, same thing with the dream at night. Sometimes, a lot of people dream between, uh, between three and five in the morning, and that's when your creative process, and it's good to have a drink of water by you or something. So the point is, I don't want to sound idiotic. The question is, what's the question? So I'm the sorry. Question is, do you feel like you come up with your best material when you're writing, or just something? Uh, when I'm inebriated, stoned out of my mind. That's the best when I come up with material. <laughs> when do you come up with the best? If I catch a fish now. If I, it's so hard to come up with material sometimes. The last thing I did, and I shot it too, I'll, and, which is, and I'll end with that on that. Uh, I, I took a rug, I bought a blue rug, and I wrapped it up in uh, a uh, sheet. And I went over here to Ralph's department store, and it said rug doctor. So I acted distraught and very upset, and like on the verge of tears. That my 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 rug is dying. <laughs> so the what the point is? Your point is, what is the point? Go ahead. Oh, <laughs> no. I, what's your point? I'm sorry. Uh, I just like, what, what do you come up with? Uh, when, when something hit me, the yeah. word "rug doctor" hit me, yeah. and it just came out of my mind. I'll, I'm going to get purchased a little blue rug and and act hysterical and whatever, and other ideas like that. I do a lot of wordplay, but wordplay doesn't transfer sometimes onto film. So I get, you got know, to say, but because I'm looking for a reaction, I'm not, you know, they, you know, when I see somebody's eyes roll up and top of their head, to me, I, that's a jewel. Oh. I caught it, you know. But uh, so I. It's hard to write, as I, I, you know, it's it's hard. But I, I always, I'm refining. I, I try to refine now. I'm in my refinement period. That's it. I'm dead, you know, creatively, creatively dead. Oh. But right now, right. And that's it. That's it. Good question. <laughs> Any others? Uh, okay, one more. Do you remember the first time you made someone laugh? Uh. I was just the opposite of 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 of, uh, of uh, what's a good word um, of laughter. I was more of a a, a, a dramatic little kid. I, I was a I was a, a more of a what's a good word? Uh, yeah, dramatic kids is a good word. A, a dramatic kid. I was just opposite of uh, 
traumatic is a good word, traumatic, <laughs> but not comedic. Uh, it, I, I don't know. I, it had to be a Weisenheim, Weisenheimer statement. I was a little bit of a Weisenheimer. A, you know, a quick, quick answer. Certain things. But I was more into uh, creating, creating, uh, at that, I guess, poetry at that time, uh, and, and more musical thing, to drama. You know, the comedy came a little bit later, but it never stopped. Mm -hmm. No hiatus. Uh, you know, I took a little, I had to go back to New York, commute, whatever, a week. But uh, I just, hopefully I can write. I, I read newspapers or some kind of print to stimulate my uh, mind. Or something will hit me. Something that's just, opposite, you know, something, oh, mm -hmm. you know. So, mother of pearl. You know, I went into I went into jewelry store I saw in Las Vegas. The guy got angry because my friend was shooting from outside, and I said, "Mother of pearl." And so I went and I said, "Look, I'm looking for the mother of pearl. Is she here?" <laughs> it's so idiotic, but yet I asked for the last name because yeah. he said, "We'll look for the we'll look for the mother." And then he, I said, "Well, is it Moskowitz? Uh, what's her last name?" And it's just the way it continued. Either that, or I'm ready for a state hospital. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> good luck. Uh, and well, I've had okay. a oh, great time. You here. had a good time? Thank you. We loved you here, man. Thank we you. We got to do part two, part three, right? Part three. Just to oh, follow up on the, those series? tapes. Yeah. So with that being said, thanks for tuning in to the Stevie Weeby Show. Um, if you haven't joined our Patreon, please join us at patreon.com slash Stevie Weeby. Uh, check out the music at StevieWeebyBandCamp.com. The album should be out soon. Okay? Uh, follow us on Instagram slash Q-U-A-N-G-O-U. If you want to send physical stuff, we have a P.O. box. Please send it to the Stevie Weeby Show, 1425 North Cherokee Avenue, P.O. Box 1391, L.A., California, 90093. With that being said, um, that's it. And happy holidays. Happy, or happy I hope holidays. you had a good Christmas. Yeah. This is after the. I hope you had a good Christmas. Hey, happy my man. Thank we're you very big. Much. We're big fans of yours. Thank you. Book this Thank man. You. Book him, Dano. <laughs>